I think so. Anyone have any other ones, Steve? Okay. Could we maybe discuss a little bit how we're going to use technology oh, yeah. during this cluster? Sure. So um, we say responsible use of technology. I like yeah. it. Is that fair? That's good. Responsibility so is good. Should we define what responsible use of technology means? Sure. So I guess just like if everyone's okay with it, we can use like a computer or a phone to look up something if like the group agrees. Yeah, I kind of like to have one device for my notes and one device for like looking things up. And what do we mean by looking things up? Like, probably if we just get stuck somewhere, like keep, yeah. the, keep the conversation flowing and can look something up. Like algorithms or like lecture notes. That so. Maybe we have to have a little bit of a discussion around that. Um, so when you say checking algorithms or checking lecture notes, you mean like as we discuss and something comes up and you immediately go and check the lecture notes? Is that what you guys are envisioning? Yeah. I think so. So I actually have a little bit of a problem with that just because I think it will defeat a little bit of the purpose of our discussions if we're quickly going to check the subject on the lecture notes or lab notes or even on the internet, then it kind of cuts off the opportunity to discuss and brainstorm and even encounter things that we're still not sure about that we might only be able to encounter if we go through the exercise of going through the things uh, from our head. So I would suggest, from previous experience, I would suggest to actually try to focus our discussions with uh, the knowledge that we have and try to exhaust that as much as possible and leave the use of those resources as a last resource thing and even just using you know, the lecture notes or all of those resources as a quick reference thing, for example, to check the meaning of terms, terminology that we might not be completely sure of, but try to brainstorm as much as we can. And even if we encounter something that we don't know, and it's okay and it's okay to go and learn and properly learn so that we can come back the next session and we actually be able to speak from it from, from our head and that will probably solidify our knowledge better.